What would you need if I bought all three bats? Um, let me ask my husband. Okay. All the tennis balls I could not find, but yeah, it's a nice tennis racket. Do you have any of the old toys? He does. He does. Morning. Good morning. Am I too early? Oh, you're fine. Okay. I appreciate you letting me look. I'm gonna take both of your skates. I'll keep looking around and see what yeah, else I can find. Perfect. Okay, yeah, I'll throw them back here. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's good. You selling any other sports gear? Yeah. Um, we are. So all of this out here. So <laughs> any of these. Bag. Okay. Not the back, but all of this. Oh, I also have this stuff too. Okay. Um, I'm not. I haven't really priced all of this yet. Okay. If you're anything, let me know. Yeah, sure. But yeah, I've got a bunch of stuff. Okay. What'd you need if I bought all three bats? Um, let me ask my husband. Okay. He's definitely the expert in that stuff. Hey, Nick. I'll do that. Okay. And I owe you, I owe her four for the ski, so 44. There you go. Sweating. Thanks Thank so you. much. Yeah. Good luck with the sale, guys. Thank you. Morning to you. Morning to you. Oh, <laughs> you have any rackets you're selling or just the bag? Tennis in. Oh, does it really? Yeah. Didn't feel like it. It's like brand new. It was my daughter. She played for Milford. My, all the tennis balls I could not find, but yeah, it's a nice tennis racket. Cool. Think about that. Okay. Usually the tennis balls would be with it, but.
I've got four dollars in DVDs, okay. and I'm gonna buy your uh, CD player thing. The oh, okay. the white. Five bucks. Uh, the, that, actually, this one. I'm sorry. Oh, this one. Yeah. Okay. So I it owe you. Seven, right? Yeah, seven. Five, six, seven dollars. Yep. Thank you. You change. No, oh, I got it. You got it. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Thanks so much. Yeah. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Yeah, I appreciate that. Morning. Morning. Sorry, I was trying to get all this How much are your movies? Uh, you know what? I did not price them. How much are the movies? Uh, I thought you said a quarter. A quarter? Okay. Yeah. This one says make offer though. What were you hoping to get out of that one? Um, I would take 15 for 15 that. bucks? Okay, let me yeah. think on that one. Thank you. Oh, you're five bucks. I've got this sweater for three and two dollars worth of movies. Okay, thank you. Thanks so thank much. You. Good luck with the sale. Thanks, have a good day. You too. Good morning. <laughs> How much is your case? Uh, what did I put on that? It's on the back. I think. Oh, is it? Yeah. Five bucks. Okay, gosh. Gotcha. Do you have any of the old toys? He does. He does, but <laughs> I don't know anything about him. But if you <laughs> want to give me your number, he can call you. Okay. You yeah. Like, sure. You. I mean, because he has a bunch of it. Yeah. Yeah. There. I'd love to take a look. Um. Here you go. You got All a right. pen and paper? I can... um, yeah. Do we have a pen and paper? I'll Thank let you. Him know. Good right, luck thanks. with the sale. Uh, thanks. Back at the house, I found a handful of things today. Nothing too crazy, but I'm pretty happy with what I bought. I got some ice skates and um, inline skates at one sale for $2 each. I should be able to sell these each pair for like 30 to 40 bucks. They are youth, uh, but brand new. These skates are like 80 to $100. dollars i wanted to point something out to you guys. If you're looking at skates, some of these modern ones have this like interesting like heel like heel and ankle support where it's not just one you know solid piece they kind of have a cutaway and a lot of these over time it just give out and they'll be damaged and 
if this if this piece right here like is broken off or it's just completely gone, just forget about it. Um, the value is pretty much done. The wheels on these inlines are very worn down, but it's not a huge deal because those can be swapped out. It's not something that I'm going to pay to do, um, but if somebody wants them, um, they can get some new wheels. Uh, I don't think that's going to hurt the value too bad. I've got this Transformers case. Uh, this is original from the 80s for five bucks. It's only worth about 20. They said they have some original Transformers toys that they might sell, so I left my number with them. Got this Packer Salute to Service hoodie for three dollars. Uh, this is going between thirty and forty. Got three bats at one sale. They had a ton of sporting goods stuff, like catcher's gear, um, a glove, a bunch of hockey stuff, some lacrosse. A lot of the prices already though were a little bit higher than I really wanted to pay to try to make any money on uh, the bats. Though I think I did okay. I paid forty for all three. Uh, this Easton and the D Marini are going between 30 and 40 each, and this Marucci is going like 70 to 80. Word of the wise, when you're out and about looking at bats, there's all kinds of stuff that you'll see on here that'll make it tricky to find an actual value, like Easton, XL3, uh, you'll see Scandium Alloy. You don't want to mess with any of that stuff. You want to find the model number um, that'll usually say model or MDL, and there it is, SL14X35. That's going to be how you find the exact value on that bat. De Marinis are notorious for making it very hard to find. You can see it under that, uh, that little line, the minus 10, VXR18 is the model on that one. Sometimes they put them like further down here. De Marinis are usually tough to find. And then on this Marucci, this one, where's it at? There it is, model MSB CCP8. So when you're out about looking up bats, some of them have some really good value, but just make sure you're looking up the model instead of like looking up, you know, cat composite or Vexum minus 10, anything like that. The exact model is gonna be what you want. Got this Philips um, under the counter CD player for three. This is going for about $30. Some of the Sony's and other brands can go for good money. If you do see these out and about and they're cheap, look them up. Some of them have some really great value. I've been buying tons of DVDs lately. Because I'm getting them cheap, 50 cents to a dollar, and uh, just keeping them. One sale had them for like a quarter each, so definitely couldn't pass that up. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.